Hari Hari Krishna. I just want to talk with you about is Hinduism the true religion? The true religion. This is an updated version from the rubbish, crackly noise that you heard earlier, or on your or, or my other video. Yeah, and I also will be talking about the sacred cow as well from this book, as you can see, the king of knowledge. Yeah, so I'll try and be quick because it's going to be a long talk. I don't know how long I'm going to be talking for. This is uns unscripted apart from this. So I'm going to be reading from... I'm going to be reading from there to there to the blue to the end. And also up here as well, this line here. And that'll be it, the first line. So let's read says this is the actual peace formula one no one can he says here this is the actual peace formula no one can have peace as long as the as he thinks i am the proprietor who is capable of claiming proprietorship only a few hundred years ago the native indians were considering considered the proprietors of america Today we in the in our turn are claiming that proprietorship are claiming that proprietorship but in four hundred or a thousand years perhaps someone else will come to claim the same. The land is here and we come here and falsely claim ourselves to be proprietors of it. The philosophy of false pro 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 is not in line with verdict injunction about the proprietorship basically so proprietorship basically means means definition of it's a definition of proprietorship definition a business that legally has no separate existence from its owner income or losses are taxed on the individual's personal income tax or uh, let me read a dictionary sorry this is not a good one proprietorship the owner of a business establishment a, ho a hotel basically because when it talks about appropriateship and talks about it, it talks about it talks about sorry I'm just trying to I was trying to cancel a Bible reading. Sorry, not well. Ignore, ignore that thing that I just said about Bible reading. Basically, basically, the where it says about proprietorship and where it says about this, it says he becomes very peaceful this is the actual peace formula no one can have peace as long as he thinks i am the proprietor because basically you're saying you you own basically they're trying to say they're trying to say they own peace so it says here the owner of a business establishment a hotel that's the meaning of proprietor Proprietor. So, so basically, basically, what, what, 
basically he's trying to say we own he owns peace but and and it's and it sounds like it's it's all over the place this this proprietorship like nobody can really find the true piece of the piece of the, the piece of Krishna Hari Krishna but uh, but if 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 it's if Hari Krishna is claiming proprietorship uh, there needs to be rock hard evidence of that rock hard evidence yeah so yeah and it says it goes again it says it's false prop it says it says this philosophy of false proprietorship is not in line with verdict injunction the verdict injunction is about the holy cow and also like i like i, I said something earlier i said something about bob about bible reading out uh, about bible reading Ignore that it's just something on my screen that that is that has happened made 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 it does that it's just something on my screen that, that that happens when it when it comes up so basically so yeah so the 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 the, the whole the holy cow like t I t when, where it says about the um where it says it says the philosophy of the philosophy of false proprietorship is not in line with verdict injunctions. So that bit, that sentence, is talking. About, yeah, like I said anyway, I told you it's about the cow. So let me let me read you something that I found online. It says here, cows are mothers, mothers of all create create creatures 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 cows are ver verily the mothers of the 33 crores of dem demigods um basically demigods is he says he says 33 33 crores of demigods i'll explain that later and it says that uh, that I, i'll explain it later in this video it says th so 33 crores of demigods that administrate creation in the material existence throughout all the universe cows are the goddess of the gods and the refuge of all auspiciousness cows bestow every kind of happiness and for these reason reason they always are worship worshipable cows are the support of all the worlds for by, uh, by their milk they nourish ter ter territorials be territorials beings and by the the ghee offered in sacrifice they nourish the den den denizens of the celestial celestial realms nothing they no sorry let me read again they nourish the den denizens of the celestial realms nothing superior to cows so i'll uh, break it down bit by bit and just I, I think i'm gonna try and go get get down to the i'm gonna do the the, the 33 crores of demigods last so there's a big readout on that one where it says it says here cows are the mo cows are the mothers of all create creatures creatures they, they need to they, uh, they, uh, they, we need we need we need we need evidence that's that's saying that they're the mothers of all mothers of all creature creatures because there's so many different type of creatures in the world how can mother how can be cows be the mothers of all that all of all those creatures there needs to be rock hard evidence like address address and things like that and it says cows are verily verily the num the, the mothers of of the 33 crores of demigods that de that administrate cre creation in the material existence throughout all the universe I'm just taking the time. So, 
So it says, Thou's our goddess of the of the, of the gods and the refuge of all auspiciousness. Basically, for cows to say they're goddess or of all the gods, there needs to be rock. There needs to be rock hard evidence saying that. Right? There needs to be an address, a postcode. If you use postcode or zip code, there needs to be rock hard evidence to say that they are gods. Not by just what they what they what they produce and make, but they need to be if they got, if they are a god or gods. There needs to be that kind of evidence, like false, like, like, old, like they need, they, you know, there needs to be evidence in the museum. Read really, that. That's that's the kind of evidence I'm really talking about. Like evidence in that museum where where security guards are protecting it 24/7. Because you've got you, you've got the you've got that that cloth that 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 they. That um that Jesus 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 was wearing when he when he was crucified and you and you can see some blood stains on it and some some I think they say that they found hairs and stuff like that and blood obviously like I've said that that's the kind of and, and it's and it's if you research it I can't recall what it was called now but if if you research it, it that that's locked away somewhere sacred in the museum but it's been it's been protected by it's been it's been protected by security that's the thing about that so the cloth that jesus wore basically just checking the time again basically the, the cloth that he wore was is called or was called Shrewd of Turin, but I'm not even sure about that name because I'm looking at w Wikipedia. Uh, so, is the Shrewd of Turin really Christ burial cloth by Bruce? Yeah, yeah, that is that is what it's called. Sorry, it's Shrewd, it's it's Shrewd of Turin, which is spelled S H R O U D of, and it's T, -T U R I N. So research, research that and get back to me if you have any problems with that. So basically, as it says, it says that there needs to be evidence like that, like the shrewd cloth. Because if 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 it's saying it's a it's a it's a god, there needs to if it, if the cows are, are are the goddess of the gods, there needs to be evidence like that, like the shrewd cloth. And yeah, so and this word, this word, on oh, not um, I press my mic. Basically, this word, one minute. This word it says it's this the meaning of the meaning of auspiciousness showing a showing or suggesting that future success is likely poor poor proportion made an uh, auspicious beginning attend by good fortune prosperous an auspicious year so it's basically good luck and good fortune auspicious so are they saying that the cows are the goddess of the gods and the refuge of all auspiciousness which is good fortune blessings but there needs to be again there needs to be rock hard evidence like the shrewd 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 cloth from jesus jesus jesus's burial and it needs to be securely, securely, securely locked away in evidence of, of blessings from that. And I read on about this website. It says, this, this is the Hindu website I'm reading from as well. So I'm not just making these things up. So it says, it says, it go, I'll go on now. So it says, cows bestow every kind of happiness. 
and for these reason and uh, for these reason they always are worshipable so they so he says how to bestow every kind of happiness and for those yeah so they, they need, again again i keep i keep i keep hitting you guys gently 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 hitting you guys with the with the question there needs to be rock evidence that these cows can give us give human beings happiness or peace everlasting peace there needs to be rock hard rock hard evidence testimony after testimony non-stop throughout the years throughout the ages non-stop and it, it has to be there needs to be please if if you can find the evidence then get back to me please rock hard evidence so i read on and for these reasons they always are worshipable cows are the support of all the worlds for by their milk they nourish terri ter 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 terrestrial terrestrial beings and by their ghee offered and and in sacrifice they nourish the densities of the celestial realms nothing superior to cows so the terrestrial beings and uh nourish the densities if we're supporting these these beings or these densities or and the terrestrial how can they know it? How can they know these things are good? Because believe you me, I I've seen de demons in I've seen demonic spirits floating about in my in my house. I've seen I've seen that kind of thing happen before, or in the house I'm living at. So how can these realms, these 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 terrestrial beings and the uh, and the densies be a good be a good thing then again there needs to be rock hard evidence and they need they need someone that, that has died there needs to be someone that has, that has died a human being that has died and come back to life and actually and actually seen these beings because there is such thing as the afterlife and people do die and come back to life and tell tell of their story their testimony and it's and it's actually real hardcore evidence from from that you know i know people well yeah so so let, so that's that's that page i wanted to show you so let me show you this one because uh, uh, i said i was going to get back to you about the about the three cr cr this, the three crores of dem demigods the 33 cr crores of demigods so let before I give you that those details about the the the, the 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 demigods, let me give you the the spelling for. Oh man. Let me give you the spelling for. Just checking the time. So the name of the cloth that the, the shrewd of Turin. Uh, I don't think I ever gave you the spelling of it. Just for you to look. Just for you to look it up. It's it, the, the spelling is S H R O U D. I think I did give it to you actually. But this is what happens when you when some of my 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 uns my stuff is unscripted. But let me give it to you again just in case. So you got the shrewd spelling and the, and. The, and this and, and it says of O F Turin T U R I N Turin. So that's the cloth that Jesus died on. So let me give you the details about the thirty three crores of demigods. So this one, there's a website I found called Is Considerary tree, and it's like a blog. It looks like a blog of people asking questions and stuff. So let me just read out some some all of these if I can, if I got enough time. Basically, 
So it says here, I think somebody was asking the question, it says, do you do we have 33 cro crores gods in in Sanathan Dharma, which is spelled uh, cro crores is C R O C R O sorry C R O R E S and gods D O D S and it's in Sanathan S A N A T H A N Dharma D H A R M A. So these are the questions, and right here, here is some of the answers. He says, "Well, well, demigods, but yes, it's because there isn't one wind demigod. There are countless wind demigods, and so on. That's why the numbers add up. Basically, about that, to to have so many gods in 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 this religion." It gets it gets a little bit it gets a little bit confusing about which one to worship and which one to 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 rely on because with so many because as as we as 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 human beings we all know once once what you know you cannot you don't have to look far to see where people can make mistakes if you if you have like people you have a group, if you have a group of people doing one thing like the government or any or any government you surely if it's if it's done by if it's done by humans and if it's and if and if a god and if a god and if a god is is um is clever enough why would a god would have would have so many countless gods after them or around them or of them why why would there be so many gods so many gods because the, the person says here is the person says here there are countless wind demigods and so on that's why the numbers add up so how can so if they if it's so many countless god, get de gods demigods surely there will be a bit of a confusion to who who is in charge you can say it's Hare Krishna but Hare Krishna says that he saying that he claims he's claiming to be God in in if if you look in my previous videos, I explained about what 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 author, what authority Hare Krishna has, and I ex and I explained to you the meanings of of those words that he that that, that the that the that the kingdom of knowledge explains about his authority, and so on. So to have these count countless gods, it. It's it's a little bit it's it's very, it can be, I think it can be and it, I think it, I think it can be and it's a little bit confusing to have so many of them to try and control so many human beings as well. So I read the next question. It says that and there are different types of different different types of wind. Sorry, that and there are different types of wind demigods. Vu is which is spelled V A Y U is the chief of the wind demigods, but there are some under under him. For example, there isn't one type of rain cloud. There are countless, and each is pre presided over by a deity who is servant of Indra. For example, Savarataka. Basically, to have all these. God's in charge. It's the same thing again, and having one in charge, it still is confusing because it's more than there's more than two or three gods that this person mentioned here. So I can, I mean, it narrows it down. But what happens if all these gods overrule each other? How can they be? How can they be guaranteed unity in this with these with these gods? How can there be unity? It's too confusing, really, to be honest with you. It's too confusing. So this one it says, "Then I do not see your mind, also prohibiji. Then I do not see your mind, also pro pro also pro probiji. That's another kind of god that they had. That that and it, let me let me read it, read on read on as well. It says, "So does it mean you are fool?" 
mindless. Um, I didn't really say that. This is what I'm reading out online. So it says, so it says, I'll read it again. It says, then I do not see your mind. Also, pro, pro, hyoji. So does it mean you are fool, mindless? So basically, I'll give you, because basically, there's, there's, there's two, the, the first two, the first two, the first two answers I gave you, the first two questions I gave you online, they're, they're two, they're, they're the two same people, and the, and this last one, which is done by Mohani, Mohani wrote, Madhu V wrote, which is what I've said already, but I'll say it again, then I, then I, it says here, she said here, then I do not see your mind, also, bro, 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 G. so, does it mean you are fool, mindless, so, I mean, this is, this is somebody else writing here, something different, so, I didn't really say that, the, like I said, it was that person, so I read, I read somebody else's, Re reply because these are all replies it says here reply from me here here krishna all glories to srila pro prohobudya five thousand years back when viyasada wrote the scriptures there were three thirty three crow demigods however now i assume that the number of demigods would have surely increased. Now that's confusing. Like I said, if you have many of those gods, surely somebody wants to be ruler of something, wants to be champion, wants to be the leader. So everybody's going to be fighting each other. And it all gets more confusing again. So it, it's just, it's just, it's, it's, to me, it seems like it's getting out of control. So I read on, it says, let's say that if someone remembers Lord Krishna at the time of death with material desires still left them one in promoted to the planet one is still left them still left let sorry still let then one is promoted to the planet of demigods to live with them and after their material desires are satiated they complete their but bah, bakati to finally go back home at the lotus lotus feet of Lord Krishna after being promoted promoted to the planet of demigods. If someone himself becomes a demigod, then the number surely must have increased from thirty three cross but thirty three crows. But if one lives with a demigod, not as demigod himself then then may be the number thirty three crores will remain the same. However, Lord Krishna is the son and Maya Maya material desires is like darkness. There are there is the sun darkness and cannot exist. Where there is the sun darkness cannot exist. So obviously where there is the name of Krishna where there is the name of Krishna, may Maya cannot exist, so such cases will surely be less. Where one will remember Krishna with material desires. Well, material is just if if you think about material things, it's it's for the to answer that question. Is it's because I mean he's saying he's saying it's to do with material desires of because um. Hare Krishna possesses material desires or with material desires basically there needs to, about all these messages here that I've read out this one this one I've just read out there needs to be rock hard evidence for these for these to be facts and about the, the, the demigods increasing there needs to be rock hard evidence apart from just someone sitting down and thinking about it there needs to be rock hard evidence like I said, address postcode somewhere where it's an in, in where it's in the museum and it's locked up and it's secure twenty four seven from from long for many from 
from 2015 years ago or from 2015 years ago there needs to be rock hard evidence then there needs to be rock hard evidence dating from that far back from 20 from from, from 2015 or 2015 years ago so let me read this out as well it says letter to J jayananda 17 Z 770505 my dear Giovanniva please accept my my blessings I am feeling very in intensely your your separation in 19 joined 1964 wait I don't know if I'm, meant to, I don't know if I'm meant to reading this join me Sorry, I had to re I had to cancel that one about I I am feeling very intensive intensely and I'm feeling very intensely your separation. So I had to cancel that I had to cancel that out. So I had to yeah, I won't I won't read that one it's a bit funny. We we'll think someone about things about someone's death. Basically, I'll read this last one. It says I think we achieve the level of demigod by taking birth in the planet. We are direct servant of Lord v Vishnu for the purpose of running the, this material world. But those 33 crows, crows are possibly the post. Why they leave new devotees take, take devotees take that place. The bit about saying it saying where it says about who are direct servant of Lord Vishnu. Uh, basically saying achieve level of demigod by taking the, the birth birth in the in the planet who are direct servant of Lord Vishnu. Basically so it, it goes show with, with the with the with the que with the questions I'm putting out to you about serving Vishnu they are saying now as well. So it's not just it's it's all really it's all really confusing because they're saying you you serving Vishnu now and you're also serving the, the cows and also maybe the, maybe the demigods. So it's so what's that? It's like um it's basically three separate gods, three separate gods. So it's, it's Vishnu, the demigods, and the cows. So that's three, and yeah, and 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 and, and, and it says and it's talking about material possessions. It's ter it's turning talking about material. It says running material world, Vishnu for the purpose. So who are direct servant of Lord Vishnu for the purpose of running the material world, but those Christian. Post and post. So let me just forget about that one. About the three gods, those three gods, it's. I'm I'm presuming as I read on there are many gods gods to serve in this in 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 Hinduism. So if there's more than three it's it, it will be just too confusing and they will all be probably fighting to take charge because there needs like I said there needs to be rock hard evidence. And to prove and to what what we have to really do is really what we have to really do to find out if, if Basically, in closing in, in this video, in closing in this video, what we have to do, let me just see if I've got anything else I need to say. One minute. So we've got done, uh, done, uh, done, uh, done, uh, done, uh, done. Uh. So basically. In close, in closing, to find to basically in closing, to find out whether 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 this book whether this book is the true is a true religion Hinduism the true religion and and this book the Kingdom of Knowledge to find out if it's, if it's the true religion. All we've got to really do is like put everything aside because basically there can only be one God. Literally, there can only be one God, because we're not, we're not, we haven't come to this planet by accident. We have, we have, we're not human beings by accident. We, we, we have a di divine appointment to be on this planet, a divine appointment. So, what we have to do is just think about this carefully, 
and just and just give you some time and just think you know what we, what we have to do is just put 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 every religion aside every religion aside put every single religion aside all the ones that you know all the ones you mean you've been told about when right right back from when you were born all the religions you, you've gro grown up with just put it all aside on your own don't do it don't do don't do this with with someone don't do this with someone with you do this completely on your own basically just 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 because there is a god no there's no doubt god god does exist all you got to do is this just do this to find out if god is real just just do this one thing just say sorry god if i've wronged you because every every human being make makes mistakes every human beings make every human being or every every human being make make mistakes so in order to, to find out if, if God is real, just because cause if, if we can hurt human beings, if, if we can hurt human beings, I'm sure we can hurt God's feelings as well. So all we've got to do is this, to find out if God is real. Just, 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 say, just say to God, if, if whatever God, whatever, just putting every religion aside, just ask, uh, just, just, just ask, just ask, just ask God to just, to just, just, just say sorry, God, if I if I made a mistake against you, if if or if I've wronged you, just ask God to, just ask God and say and say to God, I'm so, I'm sorry for what, what I've done in my past life, and I and I'm and I'm willing to find out who you are, and just ask God to reveal Himself to you. And just give it some time. You, you might have to do it. You might have to do it every day. Repeat it every day. Just give it some time until you get a response. And see what happens. If you if you if you're still struggling with this, give me a call in my in my in my message in this video, and I will be glad. I will gladly gladly help you. So that's all I have to say for now. So. Take care and Hari Hari Krishna. Thumbs up. Bye for now.